Hello, today I will explain you how you can install and enable mods into your game. So once your game launches, of course you, you come here, it's easy to the mod section. This may take a while to load sometimes. Maybe it will depend of how many mods you've already installed into the game or maybe not. Once this mod section is open, the install mods will appear here. If you don't have any mods, they won't of course appear here. And to enable them, you will need to pass them here, but we are going to talk about that soon. So first what you have to do is to install some mods, browse the workshop, the Steam workshop will pop up and you will see which mods you can install. You can either click on this button or go through your Steam app and go to the mods page, that's up to you. And once you are in the workshop, you are able to see all the mods that are available for you to download. For example, let's choose a random one, maybe for example this one. And once you are in the page of the mod, hit the subscribe button and Steam will download it for you. As you can see, it downloaded for me into my PC. And then you should head back to the game. You can do this while the game is running or while the game is closed. That's optional. And back to the game, just in case you've downloaded a mod while the game was open, what you have to do is to refresh this mod section. And the mod that you've recently installed or the mods you've recently installed will appear here. This may take a while. Just in case you've installed a mod with the game closed, all you have to do is to open the game and come here to the mod section and it will appear here without having to refresh this section. And the issue with having the game open while downloading workshop mods is this. This may happen, you won't be able to select any of the mods without restarting the game, so you will have to shut down the game after installing a mod. So let's restart the game. Once you are back to the game, head over again to the mod section and you will see your new mods installed. You should select them and drag them to this area, well actually not drag, just click on this arrow and it will be here so it is enabled and for example this one and this just in case you are playing in single player mode you don't really have to enable them through a specific order but if you are trying to join a server with uh, mods installed you will be having to enable these mods through the right order the same order that they are installed in that server and I will show you how you can know that, uh, how you know which mods are installed and through which certain order soon, just in case you are trying to join a server. To disable these mods, you just have to select the ones you want to uh, disable and put them back here by clicking on this arrow, alright? And to, for example, I'm gonna put this one to order them to rearrange them through a certain order you just have to click in the mods you wish and put them on the top or on the bottom and once you click back it will ask you to restart the game in order to enable these mods so just click yes and launch the game again back to the game you should search for a server that has mods installed or just go ahead and go to your single player game that's up to you for example i will try to join this one i already know the password and if you don't have the mods installed or the mods in the right order this error message will show up that's saying that you cannot connect the server you really have to install the mods properly in order to play in a modded server and there's an issue currently with the game, not sure if it's only with my game, but I would try to report this. It says that to enable only the following mods in a certain order, and the mods name in a certain order should be appearing on this error message, but they are not appearing currently, I don't know why. But when they appear, you will know exactly which mods and in which certain order you should enable them, okay? 
Also, I want to mention that you will have to double check if those mods are working properly and if they are up to date with the latest game version, otherwise the game may crash on start or something and to prevent that from happening you will be having to uninstall the mods from your PC. You'd have to unsubscribe to those mods through Steam. I hope this was useful, thanks a lot for watching.